Wow, this VR360 of the White House is really cool. Ooh, did I see that carpet on Wayfair? Lately, a lot of people have been asking me about Virtual Reality 360 and whether it's the right video platform for their business. Well, here's what I want you to think about. Is it viable for your kind of business? Does it really make sense? The Obama 360 tour of the White House is super cool. I'll totally admit that. But I found myself looking around at the furnishings and at the finishes inside the White House rather than really listening to what they were saying. And when something did catch my ear, I would have to stop the playhead and go back and try to find what it was they were talking about that I was interested, what particular artifact or article. And that's the problem with virtual reality 360 video is it's more meant for rooms and spaces, which is awesome, right? If you're trying to sell a house, VR 360 is amazing. But if you are trying to sell items or services, not such a great idea. What would be really cool in a VR 360 video is if there was some interactivity built in that allowed me to click on something I saw within the frame and figure out how to order it. That would be cool because I really did love that carpet inside the White House dining room. My point is that VR 360 video is just the really trendy thing right now. And it's a really great way to give your viewers an unguided tour of a space, but it's really not so great if you're trying to sell an item or a service. Traditional video is still much better for that.